Oh, apologies. I didn't see you there. You must be here for the Blue Prism Labs. Welcome. My name is Corey Donahue. I'm one of our senior solution engineers here at Blue Prism, and I'm based out of beautiful Berlin, here in Germany, as you can see. Well, now that you're here for the labs, let's get started. I'm gonna give you a little bit of an intro. We'll discuss what they are, who they're for, and what it all contains. So, what are you waiting for? Come on. Now that you're here, the Blue Prism Labs are designed to teach you the basics of what it takes to build a digital worker. Notice that I said digital worker, not just an automation. A digital worker at Blue Prism is what you're getting, and a digital worker can do any number of automations that you need it to, whether that's accounting automations, finance, period end close, quarter end close, HR, operations. You're gonna to wanna to know how to build a digital worker and to get those automations done. So with Blue Prism's drag and drop technology, we're gonna cover all the basics you need in these labs. Now this is just to get your feet wet. This isn't the official training program. That's done through the Blue Prism University where you can get your certifications and really learn how to build and master Blue Prism digital workers. But these labs will really get you on your journey. So come with us. But who are these learning labs for? Well, to be frank, they're for anyone that's interested in learning about Blue Prism and just wants to play around and see what it takes. It's free of charge, and it's just to help you get into Blue Prism. Quite simply put. But what if you're already a Blue Prism customer? Can you use these labs? Of course. Maybe you have some new hires to your COE team, or maybe you're expanding your COE team. Of course you can use these labs. Are the Blue Prism Labs designed for people wearing ties eating pretzels? Yes. Are the Blue Prism Learning Labs for Chancellor Merkel? Yes. Even Chancellor Merkel here in the German Parliament Building in Berlin is doing the Blue Prism Learning Labs. True story. Well, maybe not, but she could be. You never know. You could be a recent or approaching university graduate and want to add a new skill set to your resume, like RPA. Are these labs for you? Yes. So now that we understand what the labs are and who they're for, how many are there? Well, there's a total of 10 labs. Each lab is designed to go around eight to 15 minutes. There's a video with me narrating you through, like a Obi-Wan Kenobi, if you will, guiding you on your learning labs journey. Uh, there's also a documentation guide if you wanna go at a faster pace. You can just read on your own or maybe you're tired of my voice. I wouldn't blame you. There's also an installation video and a short little guide on that as well. So once you're done with that video, once you're done with this video, excuse me, go to the installation video and then to the labs. Now, one final note that I wanna mention, and it's a really important one. These labs are just the beginning of your RPA journey. It's just gonna cover the basics. There are incredible features like OCR and machine learning and human in the loop that aren't covered in these labs. It's just to get you up and running quick, get you a taste of what Blue Prism takes, which is that drag and drop functionality, right? It's to really show you, you don't need to be a programmer or a computer developer to have these skill sets. Once you complete these labs, the next logical step is to go to Blue Prism University, which comes with Blue Prism. And there's a lot of really great, incredible in-depth training. It's also where you get your official Blue Prism certification pass. So please go check out blueprism.com, go to the portal and you'll find Blue Prism University. That is your next step. But if you're like me, sometimes you just wanna get into the product and see what it's all about. That's what these labs are for. So have fun, get your coffee, get your tea, your water, whatever drink of choice and I'll see you on lab one. Thanks guys.